Okay, so the question's asking, write the integer that describes each situation. And so in this situation right here, in question number 11, it's a thermometer, and they're wanting to know how, what the temperature is. And so I see that the top of the bar is right here, is right here, and, um, and I knew that every dash meant two because there's five dashes in every ten. So since this is 50, there's 52, 54, 56, and 58. And I knew that's where the line ended right there on 58. So I think that it is 58 degrees. And the math practice is number five, use the math toolkit. Okay, what is the tool in this situation? Using the thermometer as the... And, and I think you could have also said on this one, uh, be precise, number six, you yeah. didn't estimate around the temperature. You count each one of those yeah. little uh, lines and saw it was right at 58. So you could have said be precise, too. Okay. All right, what well, score are you ready Little Hall deserves? Oh, All right, good job, Little Hall. That's 100 for you. Come up here and get your chest. And go up there and do number 12 for us. My next table, that's going to be Calahari Lions, number... Okay, so number 12, it's, uh, the direction says write the in integer that describes each situation, and the point is between negative 6 and negative 8, so I know that means negative s 7. There you go. And my math practice is number 5, math toolkit, number line. Okay, what score is she deserve? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Madison, you said 90. Why do you think she only deserves a 90? Because she didn't give an explanation of that. She did. She said the dots right between negative, uh, negative 6 and negative 8, and so she knows it would be negative 7. So she did give us an explanation. She gave us a, a math practice. She gave us the right answer. So I say 100. So, Lainey, you got 100. Good job. Turn off, because...